Hello, wonderful people. Tis I, the director, and Tuxedo has decided to join as a guest. Hello. And I, who didn't know your host, I finally figured out who the bloody waffles I am. Oh, bloody waffles. I think we accidentally went to the Google tab where we were Googling all the people. Uh, wait, I think we accidentally backed out or something. Let it rain. There we go, yes. Apparently, we only have three minutes when we thought we had ten. So, let's just get this over with. Let the Hunger Games begin. Alright. As the trivia stand on their podium, the horn sounds. Charlie and Trash run away from the Keonicopia. Not! Gathers as much fruit as he can. Bing bong! And Kimmy fight for a bag. Kimmy gives up and retreats. Rose and Sam run away from the cornucopia. Me runs into the cornucopia and hides. <laughs> Me! Jackie runs away from the cornucopia. Turkey finds a bow, some arrows, and a quiver. April and Jim run away from the cornucopia. Rachel snatches a pair of eyes. <laughs> Larry, Archie, Howie, and AC Slater share everything they gathered before running. Lizzie runs into the cornucopia and hides. Mr. Bean runs away from the cornucopia, so Lizzie and, uh, uh, who else are hiding in the cornucopia? Me. Okay. But not me, me. Someone whose nickname is me. <laughs> I know, it's confusing. So Mr. Bean runs away from the cornucopia. Barney, not the dinosaur, grabs a backpack, not realizing it's empty. Kermit, Mo, Jack, and Andy share everything they gathered before running. <laughs> Alright, so day one. <sighs> Kimmy thinks about home. Turkey stalks Mr. Bean. Which is uh, pretty difficult to do because he's pretty much silent. Jack tries to spearfish with a trident. Not! Catches Charlie off guard and kills him. Harry receives a hatchet from an unknown Oh, wait, all the sponsors are supposed to be Mr. Beast. So he receives a hatchet from Mr. Beast, actually. How do I forget that? Anyway, uh, Jackie hunts for other tributes. <laughs> Lizzie forces Rachel to kill Jim or Barney. She refuses, so Lizzie kills her. Uh, Larry receives an explosive from Mr. Beast. Sam searches for firewood. Archie receives an explosive from Mr. Beast. <laughs> Mo begs for April to kill her. She refuses, keeping Mo alive. AC Slater sl sets an explosive off, killing Andy, Rose, and Bing Bong. Me scares Kermit off and trash she makes a wooden spear. So how many are dead? Five within the first day. Huh, that's over three minutes. Weird. Alrighty then, maybe we do have ten minutes. Alright, so we have Charlie, Rachel, and Andy from the same district, District 5. Rose from District 9 and Bing Bong from District 4. Now, the uh, cartoon elephant thing. It's uh, it's Chandler Bing, but we thought that name would be funny. Anyway, Charlie is also not Charlie from uh, Two and a Half Men. He's a, he's a different Charlie. I didn't remember which one. Not. No, and I'm supposed to read the night ones. Oh, yeah. Not. Bashes me. His head. With a mace. Oh god, another kill. <laughs> Seriously, could you please blow your nose? That's getting really annoying. Yeah, well, I don't have any tissue nearby. Hey, Tux, you want to be my tissue? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Jack sees a fire but stays hidden. Oh, he actually left. Mo defeats Mr. Bean in a fight but spares his life. Here we go again. Larry attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Aw, Jim and April hold hands. Okay. Let's get this straight. Kimmy attack. Wait, I'm supposed to read it. Oh, yeah, sorry. Kimmy attacks Barney, but Turkey protects Barney, killing Kimmy. <coughs> <coughs> I didn't think anything would kill Kimmy because she's the unbreakable. Yeah, well, it's the Hunger Games. Eh. Uh, he looks at the night sky. Lizzie and AC sleeps with Slater. Huddle for warmth. Sam, Kermit, Trash, Jackie, T 
tell each other ghost stories to lighten the mood, and Archie tries to treat her infection. Oh, Tux didn't leave. Hi, Tuxie. Hello. You just freaked me out. I know that's all. All right, can I read this one, y'all? Sure. Ooh, Barney falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Jackie begs for Jack to kill her. He refuses, keeping Jackie alive. You know, you're my home girl, my home skillet, my diggity dog. Houdini, make a promise to me right now. Okay, anything. What is it? Never, ever, ever say those words again. Sorry, I was trying to be hip. I know. Never do it again. All right. How he makes a slingshot. Um, Mo stalks Kermit. <laughs> Lizzie begs for not to kill her. He refuses, keeping Lizzie alive. <laughs> His name is Nut. Trash receives medical supplies from Mr. Beast. Turkey, Sam, and Larry get into a fight, and Sam kills them both triumphantly. Archie and Jim fight Mr. Bean and A.C. Slater. Mr. Bean and A.C. Slater survive. Survive! April bleeds out due to untreated injuries. So, whew, eight cannon shots. That's a lot more than last night. In fact, that's three more. All right, so me, Kimmy, Barney, Turkey, Larry, Archie, Jim, and April. And only Jim and April are from the same district. Wait, what happened to them? I forget. But we don't have time to look, so we'll look later. <laughs> hmm... Night two, Jackie thinks about winning. Not tries to sing himself to sleep. Kermit receives an explosive from Mr. Beast. He'll probably wind up accidentally detonating it and dying. Speaking of dying, Mr. Bean dies of dysentery. <laughs> How he thinks about home. Mo, Sam, and Trash get into a fight, and Trash triumphantly kills them both. <laughs> Jack starts a fire. We didn't start the fire, and the world's been burning since it's been turning. Yes, yes. We don't have that much time left. Speed it up. Lizzie severely injures A.C. Slater, but puts her out of her misery. Whew. Wait, I thought A.C. was a boy. Yeah, I probably forgot to change the gender again. Uh... Just ignore it. It's time for the feast. Okay. Who wants to eat it? Me, 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 me. Okay, Sasha, go ahead. Lizzie gathers as much food into a bag as she can before fleeing. Jackie, Kermit, and Trash and Howie decide not to go to the feast. Not dies from an infection. And Jack bleeds out due to untreated injuries. Well, that was, uh... Unexpected. Oh, God, gosh, gee whiz, I'm tired. Harry tends to Lizzie's wounds. Wait, didn't she just die? No, 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 she got supplies. Oh, yeah. Howie decided not to go. Kermit makes a slingshot. Trash begs for Jackie to kill him. She refuses keeping Trash alive. Why? Anyway. Oh, wait, it's not the night. Okay, phew. All right, six cannon shots can be heard in the distance. That's less than yesterday. So it keeps going down, up, down, kind of like a flow chart. So Mr. Bean from District 1, Mo from District 12, Sam from District 9, AC Slater from District 11, and Newt from District 3, F. F in the chats for Mr. Nut. And Jack, District 10. Mr. Tuxedo is asleep. Alright. Howie tends Trash, Kermit, and Lizzie away from his fire, and Jackie passes out from exhaustion. Uh-oh, we really don't have that much time left. Alright, Kermit and Trash... Wait, I was supposed to read that last one. It doesn't matter, we're supposed to... um. Speed this up. Oh, oh, I see now. Kermit and Trash split up to search for resources, and so does Lizzie and Jackie, and Howie searches for firewood. Please die. No cannon shots today, of course. 
Kermit quietly hums, Trash tries to treat his infection, Jackie goes to sleep, and Howie begs for Lisa to kill him. Huh, it didn't end again. She refuses, keeping Howie alive. Wait, does that mean I could have read it? Yes, you can read the next one, okay? This one? Yeah. Jackie fishes. Lisa is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Trash injures himself. And Howie, Howie begs for Kermit to kill him. He refuses, keeping Howie alive. Oh my god, it's between Jackie, Lizzie, Trash, Howie, and Kermit. I don't think Kermit's gonna kill anybody, though. Like, he's always so innocent. Yeah. Okay, night five. I can read this one. Alright, Kermit receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Jackie thinks about winning, and so does Howie. Lizzie receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Trash attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Uh, Kermit... Kermit and Lizzie hunt for other tributes. Trash explores the arena. Jackie and Howie split up to search for resources. There, your turn's over now. Wait, I still gotta read the night one. Oh, yeah. Once again, no cannon shots. Kermit, Howie, and Trash sleep in shifts. Jackie passes out again from exhaustion, and Lisa is unable to... I mean, Liz, 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 Lizzie is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Alright. So now it's my turn. Kermit scares Lizzie off. Trash and Howie threaten a double sewer slide. It fails and they die. Again, task successfully failed. And Jackie questions her sanity. So, and within the first week, within the first three days and nothing happening, we finally get two deaths. Yep. District 11 and District 7, Trash and Howie. I'm glad Trash finally died, you know? He was literal trash. Okay, maybe we only have 13 minutes. Kermit stays awake all night, same. And Jackie tends to Lazy's wounds. Oh, that's nice. No, oh, wait, I was supposed to read that. You can read this one. Okay, and then the next one, right. Kermit and Lizzie work together for the day, and then Jackie questions her sanity again. Oh boy, no cannon shots today. Kermit cries himself to sleep. Lizzie loses sight of where she is, and Jackie unknowingly eats to to toxic berries. Oh my. So now it's between Kermit and Lizzie. Ooh, Lizzie poisons... Kermit's drink, but mistakes it for her own and dies. You fool. You fell for the old blunder. Is, is that the right line? I don't know, dude. I don't know. But that means Kermit won. Kermit! Yes, the winner is Kermit from District 1. Again, a career district. That's weird. Alright, so now you can see who everyone is. So we got Kermit, obviously the winner. Lizzie McGuire. Uh, she had two kills, apparently. Jackie Burkhart. But like I said, Kermit didn't kill anybody, so he was innocent. Uh, everyone tried to kill him, or begged him to kill them. But he was like, nah, bro, nah, I'm not gonna kill anyone. I don't want your dead body on my conscience. You know, I don't want your ghosts haunting me. In my dreams or something. Anyway, we got Howard Wallowitz. Uh, Zach Morris, who was trash. Uh, Jack Donaghy, who was just Jack. Dr. Barry, Be <sighs> Dr. Perry Cox, who was not. <clears throat> A.C. Slater, who seems to have the most kills. Let's see, five kills? Yep, that's the most. Sam Malone. Two kills, but like I always say, sometimes the underdog comes out on top. Fadini, I will once again say this. Never, ever, 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 ever say anything like that again. Alright. We got, um, yeah, we can't pronounce her name, so we just called her Moo. 
And then we have Mr. Beast, April Ludgate, or Ludgate. We didn't know, we just decided to call her April. Jim Halpert. Uh, Archie Bunker. Larry David. Chris Turk. Who was Turkey, I believe. I didn't remember. Bonnie, who was Barney Stinson. Kimmy Schmidt, you know, the unbreakable one. <laughs> uh, I told you to blow your nose like 15 minutes ago. Yeah, well, I don't listen. I noticed. Marshall Erickson, who is probably Marshall. Chandler Bing, who is Bing Bong. Rose Nyland, who is uh, Betty White's character from um, Golden Girls. Oh, Eddie Dwyer from The Office, obviously. Rachel Green from Friends, who uh, didn't even kill anyone. And Charlie Kelly. So, yeah. Barely anyone killed anyone in the bloodbath no death occurred, but day one not catches Charlie off guard and kills him. Lisa forces Rachel to kill Jim or Bonnie. She refuses, so Lizzie kills her and said, Oh yeah, that's right. Uh Ace Slater sets an explosive off killing Andy Rose and Bing Bong. Um <laughs> Nut bashes Me's head with a mace that kinda sounds like Cookie Monster. Mies want some cookies, or something like that, I don't know. Kimmy attacks Bonnie, but Turkey protects him, killing Kimmy. Ooh, that was harsh. Barney falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Turkey, Sam, and Larry get into a fight. Sam kills them. Archie and Jim fight Mr. Bean and AC. AC and Mr. Bean come out on top. Sorry. April bleeds out due to untreated injuries. Mr. Bean dies of dis dis dysentery. Boo, Sam, and Trash get into a fight. Trash kills the booth. Huh? Wait. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, because Trash was the third person there. It's always the last person who kills. No, wait, because Sam killed Larry and Turkey, so it, yeah, it's just, it's random. Nut dies from an infection. Oh, wait, I didn't say his name right. Nut dies from an infection. Jack bleeds out to un due to untreated injuries, both at the feast. Day three through night six, nothing happened. So that's like three whole days of nothing happening. Trash and Howie threaten a double sewer slide. It fails and they die. Oh, by the way, Dio. Yeah. I found out how that, um... Hey, it's 69%. Holy crap. And it's almost 420. Well, not quite, but still. Anyway, I was saying, I found out how that, uh... Heal incantation goes. Oh, yeah. How's it go? Flower gleam and glow. Let your power show. I don't remember the rest of it, but you were wrong. That's the point I'm trying to make here. Alright. Uh, night 7 and day 8, no deaths. Uh, night 8, Jackie annoyingly eats toxic berries. <laughs> Blow your heckin' nose, man. Not a man. What are you? Yes. What? <laughs> Whatever. Lizzie poisons Kermit's drink, but mistakes it for her own and dies. And the winner is Kermit. Kermit! Alright. So as you can see, like I said earlier, A.C. Slater is the one with the most kills. But like we always say, there is no such thing as... Wait. What do we always say? The number of kills, right, the number of kills doesn't exactly guarantee you win. It just guarantees you get sponsors. Uh-huh. All right. In case we don't get to do the uh, outro and intro on this one, goodbye, wonderful people. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe. And uh, who wants to say it? Subscribe. All righty, then. We'll end it at 20 minutes.
。